comrade, party leader, and your beautiful wife. Chairman of the party, our general secretary, and all the comrades on the platform. Comrades, God is good. God is good. Thank you for your prayers. God is good. As a former regional chairman, I'm so proud to see the Region 3 Posse. Big up the Region 3 team. I am here to speak briefly on behalf of the parliamentarians. I know, comrade leader, sometimes the comrades, the hardcore, believe that we're not strong enough enough. But I can say tonight, the 14 of us in parliament are stronger than the 49 of them in the same parliament. And sometimes the comrades don't see what goes on behind the scenes in parliament. Because enough times you see me get up or the leader get up to go behind the seat, the, the seat of the speaker is negotiate them and negotiate with us you know, as to how to run the parliament. And despite the level of arrogance we see from time to time, we are better than the 49 of them in that parliament. And when it comes for us to ball out, we ball out. Because we still believe it was unfair for the government to remove the chairmanship of the oversight committees from the opposition. And we are saying again tonight, put back the chairmanship into the hands of the People's National Party MPs in the House. And we also say to them, because and on yesterday or last week, Fitz Jackson, I try to get the banking sector under better discipline and regulations. The fees are too high. Bring the bill to Parliament so Fitz Jackson law can be passed. But you know, comrades, our most e effectiveness, the most effective Parliament that we have had in terms of the opposition is when it comes to legislation. And at this time of the pause, to big up the party leader as one of the greatest legislators in our parliament. When them bring, when them bring a bill to parliament, they come to ask me, you discuss it with the party leader, how you feel about the bill. Some say, I'm not so happy, you know. So them say, what him want to change? Because they're afraid for him to get up and talk about the changes to come. And I say to you, junglist, you have a representative in the parliament that is most effective. And big up the party leader in his home. And sometimes things get hot in the parliament. Sometimes we have to walk out. Sometimes we have to go to court. And this government has lost so many court battles. The last battle in relation to the special, the NIDS, National ID, and of course, they lost the round dealing with the state of emergency. But comrades, I want to say to you tonight that there are some core reasons why these elections, as Julian and Tony have said, we have to treat them differently. Because the truth is, People don't take local government elections seriously. And I want to say to you, a low turnout favors the government. So it is our duty to go out there and get every comrade, but also independents, to go out and vote on Portia Simpson Miller Day to get the PMP to cover these municipalities. My, my Region 3 brothers and sisters, and I'm taking a little claim, credit enough, because 
You see the amount of women representing the party in Region 3. It started under my leadership. Not true, Angela. So I am proud of that. But the party leader has asked me to go to St. Thomas to bring home the 10 seats. And comrades, we have a big surprise coming for St. Thomas. We have a massive surprise coming for St. Thomas. So as I bring you greetings, may I invite my two ladies who hold up my hand in East Kingston and Port Royal, Lauren Dobson and Jacqueline Lewis, come forward. Them can pray, you see. Them can pray. Yeah. Thank you very much.